Yeah, so I kind of wanted to, to start off by speaking a little bit about your stage presence, because it's quite, uh, you know, intense and, and formidable on stage. Yeah. Was that something you had right from the off, or did it take a, did you kind of build up to that and take a while? We built up to that. <laughs> yeah. 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 Um, I always like knew I wanted it to be like kind of uh, flamboyant and stuff, but had to grow into it. I think. But yeah, I think the number of shows we've played this year as well. I think it's like helping keep things fresh. I think just so. Yeah. Yeah. Played played a lot of the songs a lot of times now, so it's it's nice to add some new stuff nice about changing the songs. Yeah. <laughs> Talk to something to talk about your to talk to your bandmates about after the gig when it's like when you did that thing that was sick. <laughs> the guitar yeah. part's probably not going to change. So, yeah. yeah. When Finlay came into the band, did that like affect the stage dynamic and the stage presence? Oh, like that was probably the main thing because <laughs> of that. Yeah. I, was, I was playing bass before. It's changed the groove. It's changed the songs. Even if he's not writing them, you can we can be like, yeah, we can make this. A, a slinky bass line or whatever. Um, and I could, you know, interact with the crowd a lot more, dance, try and think of some choreography. Yeah. Kind of feels like a new band, almost, to be honest, since yeah. Finley's joined. It's been yeah. amazing. Yeah. Now I have to ask about Interpol as well, in terms of live gigs, because that was the first gig I saw you at, yeah. and that was the first gig at the stage and everything kind of hit me. What was that like? What was your mindset going into that, and did you get to meet them? In do you want me yeah. to be honest, or do you want to give a <laughs> fucking like... <laughs> honest, right, okay, cool. Uh, I think... I don't, I don't think Interval are that fun live. <laughs> so, uh, we kind of wanted to do, like, be, be fun. But it was good. <laughs> but, yeah. uh, and we and we glad, like, people... I have lots of people come up to us and say that was a great show. But the, the audience are kind of similar to the band in the way that they're quite stationary. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. It was an amazing experience. Yeah, but yeah. like, yeah. I know, I'm I feel, so I've, grateful that we got it. But yeah, we were always going to struggle with that crowd. I think, yeah, but yeah. it was it was still great. It was amazing to play such a massive room, as well. Yeah. And something that's kind of present in the band is androgyny, and kind of that's something that you've spoken about in your music, and it's something that you do uh -huh. with your image to an extent as well. Uh -huh. In terms, like with stereotypes of masculinity, do you think music is a more effective tool nowadays to kind of, you know, bring new ideas to people than it has been in the past perhaps, or can I say? Sometimes, uh, it's hard to comment as a band, even though we fight, well, we know that we, we st like, are like, exp want people to express themselves and like make uh, people of whatever gender to feel comfortable and like obviously hyper-masculinity is, is like so toxic and the world should be rid of it. But it is hard to comment on that as males in a band because we don't face the same struggles that the women and non-binary people do. Um, but, you know, anything we can do, we will. And anything we can say, and I do write about, you know, feeling, not maybe feeling comfortable with the male gender quite a lot. Uh, but, yeah. <laughs> and it's, it's something that's discussed, like I said, in your music. In the latest single, do you feel you kind of touch upon it in that at all? Or? Um, the latest single is ish. It's, it's more of a, it's more just a sad song about my life. <laughs> but uh, but uh, I think it was touched upon because it's kind of like about my mom and I feel like like uh, the, the feminine parts of myself are, are, I get from my mom. And uh, that's what this, the, like, uh, the cover I wanted to kind of it to look like, because I do look quite like her, I wanted to express that with like eye makeup and making sure my hair was long and stuff. Um, but that's less so, but like obviously my pop sensibilities uh, is, is talks about it a lot. And and, song, uh, and lots of unreleased songs as well that we'll be playing tonight. <laughs> you mentioned the, the cover up for the new single there. Mm -hmm. That's obviously something that's quite big as well, the photography and yeah. the, the aspect of the band. Yeah. At what point did that kind of start to come into it and uh, that passion of the game? Every, basically everything that I give a shit about is that happened in the past year. <laughs> uh, uh, but we, I don't know, just, just kept them getting more interested in all types of art and fashion and photography. And like, I, I appreciate bands when I like a band when they think about every aspect. Like the, the, the move that they're going to do on stage, 
the like the photo and how they're thinking about the video when they were writing the song and stuff like that. So, you know, it's always been there. I always knew that I wanted that song to have a photo of me kind of looking a bit, you know, vulnerable and feminine. But, um, and, and we're using, uh, D Dylan Moore is photographing all of the, the artwork and he's doing the videos as well. And he's so talented. And he, I think he gets the, what we want from every photo shoot. So, yeah. <laughs> yeah. And to wrap up, when you, when you play your music and music will respond to it, which emotion do you think it most strongly evokes in people? Uh, depends what so I'd, ooh, that's tough. <laughs> uh, well, yeah. I, I hope, even though some of our songs are sad, I hope joy in feeling comfortable in yourself. Because that is probably how most people find happiness. Like, um, is, is finding it within yourself, not from other people. Uh, yeah, so that. <laughs> yeah. yeah. So, thank you very much. Right, thank Cheers. you so much. Yeah. It's been fun, yeah. Cheers. Cheers. Thank you so much.